posture is actually very important when it comes to sitting meditation and yet is trickier than one might think to find one that is comfortable, that is steady. You want to have your spine straight, your shoulders open, your hips relaxed and sometimes there is too many ingredients to fit them all in one equation. I suggest use a cushion under your buttocks to lift your center and facilitate your spine to be straight. I suggest to keep your knees resting on the floor rather than hanging and if that means that you have to put one or two blankets under the knees, do so. I also suggest that if the room that you are practicing is fresh, cover yourself with one, maybe two blankets because as you relax, your body temperature will drop even further. All this said, if you have any physical problems, severe pain, if you're a little older and you feel fragile in your body, you can also practice sitting on a chair or even laying down. To keep the posture, you will have to be on. So it gives you something to focus, something else than the constant repetitive stream of thought. And reversely, if you lose that focus, your posture will disappear, will whine, and that will remind you that somehow you lost yourself. So it's very useful that way. This sitting in between complete inactivity but simultaneously requiring our commitment to maintain the posture makes this position a physical representation, a physical metaphor of the middle way. Comfortable enough to be, keep it steady for a number of minutes, enough needing our participation so I have to be on the whole time. Very useful. So we practice? Get a cushion, sit on it, take all your time, fidget all you want until you're comfortable, and let's start. Let's sit. Allow both legs to rest heavy from the hips and give a little lift to the heart region at the center of the chest. Subtle, but constant. The heaviness at the hips will ground you and give you stability, while the lift of the heart will keep your posture open and your mind awake. Rotate your shoulders open and rest them, letting the arms hang heavy from them. Elbows and wrists soft. Fingers soft. As your shoulders soften and find a place, see if there is any tension in your neck or jaws that you can easily identify and drop. Relax your face. Relax your eyes, your lips and tongue. And finally, see if you can allow your belly to soften and fall a little heavier. A couple of deep exhalations through the mouth can help. Let's go through it all again. Hips and legs. Shoulders and arms. Relax. Neck and face. Maintain your heart tall, but relax your belly. Exhale. Hips and legs, shoulders and arms, relax. Neck and face, relax. Maintain your heart tall, but soften your belly. Exhale. 